Democrat, Senator John McCain here in the Irish Women Program. Democrats take over essentially in uh, Congress today, and mm-hmm. people voted for them uh, essentially. Uh, these polls and all these various other barometers tell us because uh, it may not be a consensus, but the overwhelming majority of people who weigh in on this want us to cut our losses and get out of Iraq. Does that impact on you at all? Well, I understand their frustration. I understand the American people's frustration. I would argue that if it was just that simple, then uh, that Americans just want us out under any circumstances. I don't think Joe Lieberman would have been reelected in a very liberal state. I think they're frustrated. I think they're sad uh, because of these continued losses, and I certainly understand and grieve with them. But I believe that, you know, they're always saying, well, what's our plan B? What is the plan B if we just withdraw? I believe, uh, uh, getting a little repetitious, I think you're going to see chaos in the region. I think you're going to see a Kurdistan that that scares the heck out of the Turks. I think you're going to see the Iranians playing in behalf of Shia. I think Saudi in favor of Sunni. The Syrians will be emboldened both there and in Lebanon. Uh, Look, you know, Bill Russell once said, when things go bad, things go bad. After our initial victory, you may recall the Iranians and the Syrians were very cooperative and very helpful. When they see us weak, they want to exert their influence and they want to have uh, their goals, which by the way are the extinction of the state of Israel, if you believe the president of Iran, uh, and they want our influence out of the area. Uh, By the way, it's also an argument for energy independence, but that's subject of another discussion.